I've got a quick little tip for you guys today. A lot of you that go out camping, wild camping, etc., hiking and take your animals with you may have noticed that they come back with ticks on them. That's obviously because they've been around sheep and cattle and just in the long grass in general. And um, I've seen a few things on the internet about how people take them out using Vaseline to try and suffocate the tick and alcohol to try and um, rub that on the back of the tick in the hopes that it drops off. All of these I wouldn't really recommend. There is an easier way to do that and I'm gonna show you guys how to do that now. So you can do this with your bare hand. I don't think there's gonna be any long lasting issues if you do that, but obviously I've chosen- Don't you dare touch me, stand back! To put a little latex glove on, just because I don't like the feel of ticks. I think they're absolutely disgusting little things. But um, yeah, let's jump straight into this and show you how it's done. Okay, so you can see there that there's um, a tick well and truly lodged in to poor Tallulah here. What we need to do is rub the back of the tick, keep the tick rotating. You can do this either way, clockwise, anti-clockwise, it doesn't really matter. Keep the back of the tick moving. There shouldn't be too much discomfort for the dog. And hopefully you'll see that this thing starts to back its way out. There we go, and you can see that all, all intact. As you can see, it's out now. It does take a while for it to let loose of the dog, but um, go for maybe two or three minutes, and this thing will just let loose and drop off. Bye-bye.